Doing this stuff, uh, doing what she does with, these, with any of them, doing these clues, and just hide them in random places. Like, why not just keep them in your face? Like, I mean, what do you guys need the clues? I 
I guess they need a food, but like they literally are leaving them in the weirdest spot. I have 31, but I am very close to the end. I'm not looking around, but no, they wouldn't, they wouldn't let me. Very rude. I know for sure. Seriously, I, almost every level I... Oh, hey, there we go. But I... Ne nearly every level that I miss a... Bolt on... I... Uh... It's, I miss one. I mean, there was that one, like, in, I think back in Mesa City where I missed, like, five. But still... Press the circle to enter I'd rather the not miss these. Okay, okay, this is kind of a guess, but... Try one, two, eight. So what about if this doesn't work? Then you get to live another day. These are the blueprints to Miss Ruby's production facility. I'll pipe this information into your binocucom. Use it to find breakables and clues nearby. That's good. That's a good thing to have. It actually is. I'm not being sarcastic. I'm being good. Some people can't tell when I'm being sarcastic. I got a voice that kind of sounds sarcastic. Oh yeah, some people can't tell when I'm being sarcastic. I'm a very sarcastic person. Let's see. You... no. You map. Hey look! Another one that doesn't have a vault. Can you guess how much I love this one? I'll do this one and then uh, unlock the next area and we'll end it there. See, I've been there with Pony Lake. Do this through there. Real quick. Oh, they're all the same. That didn't work. That didn't work at all. But this level is still better than Piranha Conda. I watched that movie. It was pretty bad. Sly, the only way to open up that voodoo gate is by lighting all 25 tiki torches with the flamethrower on your swamp skiff. Use the left analog stick to steer and press the X button to fire the flamethrower. Oh, and one more thing. You need fuel from the flamethrower, and the only source of oil are those piranha you see swimming around. Run them down with a boat. One fish fuels one shot. Hurry, you only have two minutes to get all the torches lit. And time is, but I don't want to this. Thank you. 
Big problem is he's trying to figure out where they all are. I was right there. I really don't like this one. And I said with all of them. Mostly just chasing these opponents on the highest part. The highest part.
There's so many different things they could have done that could have made it a little bit easier. Like, they could have made it fun at this point, but you have to be doing it. They even let you pull your know, hand uh, shot instead of five. unlock the cauldron's lid, I might be able to thrash their production and build up enough steam pressure to get launched up to Ruby's Skull Temple. Okay, sounds like we've got a plan. To get around that thing, try moving in the shadows made by the masks so that the guards won't see you. Alright, yeah, thank you, Benny. Not what I meant to do, I meant to, I meant to press pause. But I'm gonna end it off there. So, next time on Fly Cooper and Thievius Vicarious, we will be Hopefully finishing up Ruby's hideout. I'm pretty sure there's no more of those missions I hate, right? Maybe I'm wrong. Let's see. Oh yes. This I don't like that one. Let's see it. Oh, hmm. Don't remember this one. So it looks like there's two more that I don't like. I I'm pretty sure I remember what this is, but I don't remember this one. Hmm. Actually I might, but anyway. That's enough rambling. So, next time we'll be continuing on here and then hopefully fighting Miss Ruby, who is actually one of my more favorite boss, boss fights in this game. Anyway, 